Hey everybody, my camera streaming is broken. So I processed an upgrade on Synology to the latest firmware and it broke my streaming capability in Home Assistant. Um, Ram Gogata actually pointed this out in one of the comments to my YouTube, on my YouTube video uh, that I did about the Synology cameras that the recent upgrade broke it. So I did a ton of searching. I found a fix for this. It's a manual update, so I'm gonna show you in this video how to manually update your Synology system with patch files. We're gonna show you where to get them, how I did it, and at the end, it's gonna fix the home system issue. So let's go fix it. This is the issue. When I click camera three, you can clearly see it just does not stream. It just sits here and then eventually times out. From a browser, we then have to go and download the new service pack for the surveillance system. The links are in the blog article. So just look in the description, go to the blog article. I have all the details, including the password to download this patch. This is from Synology Engineer. It's a preview, eventually it'll be out. The one you need is the HI3535 version. This is for the surveillance system. So now that we have that, let's go to the surveillance system and install. So the software we actually have to upgrade is the surveillance station. So we're gonna go to the package center. And then we are going to click manual install. We're going to browse to that file that we just downloaded. Next. So this is both uploading the file and then verifying it. So it might take a little bit of time depending on your system speed. So we're gonna continue. This is, it, it might not be signed. This is from a developer. You can read about all of this in the blog post. I'll give some more details and links to the sources. So this is what we want. We wanna to upgrade to 5829. So 5828 is the one that's broken. This one should uh, fix the API. So we're gonna click apply. The other option to not upgrading uh, to the latest version would be to downgrade to the version before this. Uh, I have time-lapse and I have some other features within the surveillance system that I really like um, that are, were part of the new one. So I don't want to downgrade. So this is, this is the option that makes sense for me. Okay, so it finished. We're just gonna check installed. And we're gonna see here that we've uh, installed it today, which is perfect. We can click open. <clears throat> this is the web view, of course. So first thing we're gonna do is click live view just to make sure everything still works. We don't need any help. So I did just open it twice. Okay, perfect. This is that camera one. It takes a little while for all of it to flesh out um, because of the location. But I'm happy with this. So this is perfect. Now let's jump to our home assistant. Uh, I'm not even gonna click refresh. I'm just gonna click one of our objects. And there we go. It's now working again. So you can see the time, you can see it ticking away. Um, and this is a full stream. So this is excellent and it did pop up. So this looks like it's fixed. So hopefully this is helpful for you. This is how we upgrade the firmware for that surveillance station. Mine again was the NVR 1218. Uh, check out the video here. I think uh, YouTube thinks you will love it. So I will see you in that video. Take care.